tips Paco Bassa Puisi Chicaramba Jagadet Chuanino Chicapi Havana Kutaura Pachopa Dina Remero Kutambura Jacum and Daga Vijero Munyama Dufunga Naga Gaze Wapana Anunzi Dambu and Dinongo Peze Daimbo Timba Potential I have tried to take my bath at a crossroads like what we were saying yesterday, but nothing has worked. Welcome again to this wonderful edition of Witchcraft Processes and How It Works. Welcome to this session, our online family. Apostle, we welcome you once again. Thank you so much, sir. Uh, from myself, Pastor Michael, and GM Ministries Pretoria, we also welcome you, online family. 
Thank you. Right. Today we are continuing from where we dropped it yesterday. Yesterday we were speaking on the density and how the spirit, the, 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 the evil spirits work in every form or type of witchcraft. Yeah. So to conclusion, we came with the conclusion that the uh, evil spirits or the spirit is the center of every form of witchcraft. witchcraft. Yeah. Can you maybe uh, take it from there, Apostle? All right. Uh, yesterday we spoke, I, I think the previous two days we were speaking about the types of witchcraft. Uh, but uh, at the last, like yesterday, we said the spirit is the center stage, is the center of everything. Yeah. Because you might do it manual, manually, but you still need the spirit to help you to push up the processes. Yeah. Or sometimes transfer the bomb that you have created here to the person that you are targeting. Right. So the spirit is always the center. In most of the witchcraft, in most of the types of witchcraft that we spoke about, uh, the spirit is the center. It's the, it is the power giver. Like uh, us Christians, if the spirit is lacking, uh, we are also lacking everything. We are also lacking power. What you'll be only having is the weight without power. But when the spirit is present, this is the reason why Jesus said to the 12 disciples, would tarry in Jerusalem yes. until the Holy Spirit comes to you. When he is released, you will receive power. So the power, the real power comes from the spirit. Yes, you can know the technologies about how to use moti. You can know the technologies about how to create a bomb of bad luck. But all this, for it to work, the inspiration or the empowerment comes from the spirit. So that's the, 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 the epicenter of all, all, all of these uh, witchcraft stuffs. Okay. So, if you have your Bible with you, the scripture that the apostle has just called uh, we get it from Luke chapter 24 verse number 49 where it says tarry ye therefore in Jerusalem until you are endured with the power from on high right then in Luke in Acts chapter 2 now we hear that when they were together waiting in Jerusalem in the upper room the promise of the Holy Spirit came upon them then from there, we hear all the wonders that have happened. Even ourselves, we are part of that wonder of the Great Commission that was asked by Jesus for the disciples to wait for in Jerusalem. Yeah. So it works exactly the same then. So let's say is a father who has put a curse or a spell on his own child. Let's say a curse, right? How does the spirit work in parental, witch, parental power? Okay, uh, if the, pa the, 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 the father kisses you, he kisses you physically. Yes. Right, that's him uttering words. Yes. But what empowers those uh, very well. uh, words for them to, 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 to come to a level of working? That's the spirit, right? But what I'm not really sure, on the level where the father kisses you, which spirit works there? The Holy Spirit or the evil spirit? I think it depends on the case, on the type of a case, right? On that the, is coming, and, and I think if God is going to intervene there, intervene there, interfere there, it is all about the legalities that we are talking about. Good. Yes. Is he casting you on a right thing? Then, if he is casting you on a right thing, you did wrong, and you are supposed to be cased. Definitely, that's the spirit of God that will push the thing to go as he's supposed to. Okay, we've got a song that we played. Is it yesterday or day before yesterday? That one which says Fauna. Fauna, right. Right. Yeah. By not calling, you can receive a curse. Yeah, remember, it, there is a verse which says, uh, honor your parents, your father and mother, yes. so that things can go well. That, yeah. That's the Bible. Yes. It is telling you the failure to honor, then you will die. Yes. So you will be even killed by the Spirit of God. Okay. Mm. So in everything, there is a Spirit, spirit that pushes. Is, yeah. Okay. Then, I also get to realize that when it is a scapegoat type or a power of witchcraft, it shows that the spirit is the one that will be like a Bluetooth connecting the radars 
I, I, Bluetooth is even shorter. Let's speak of the, uh, the, 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 the signal of cell phones. You can mm. call someone who is in the UK yeah, from but, here. But the power is not in the physical. MON is where everything is processed today. Right. For you to connect somebody yes. who is in UK, MON is, is, is a, where everything happens. You can say, yeah, then it, right, like, like right now, people are watching us from different uh, corners of the world. But the real thing is happening, MON. Yeah. Yeah. So, you see, so, is, so, so, he, he, <laughs> MON is everywhere. I'm telling so, you. Apostle, you're telling me that these people are scientists. That's why we call it African magic. Yes, it? it's African magic. Oh, okay, <laughs> Pastor Michael, do you know here, Seuss is here? Yeah. MTN is here. Yes. Voda is here. here. Any kind of network is here. But it's, it's not visible, but it's there. How do you see it? You have a physical gadget. Then you will know. Then it will tell you the network is on. Uh, we have two bars, we have three bars, or we don't have any. So its presence can be seen by f- the, 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 the physical object. But the, 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 the you you can see by the results, but you can't okay. see them. You can hear because the wind is blowing, but you can't see it. But the evidence of its presence, you can see it by the tree shaking. Yes. Yes, witchcraft, you might say, what, 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 what? But the, 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 the substance. Right. This brings me to, to the subject of today. Yeah. But before we go there, the other day we were checking which signal is the best one here. So we were forced to, to do what is called a, a network speed test. Yeah. I remember I used your phone to do it. And it picked MTN Beira. Beira Maputo? Yes. My God. Then for the second time, it picked MTN, I picked Vodacom Randback. Yo? Right. So, that's how witchcraft work. They can send, they can decode their signal mm. from wherever they are. But now today, after they decode their signal, the spirit transfers or moves those things towards their a uh, target now as for the target how does the target realize or identify or notices that i'm under the influence of the wrong spirit here or i'm under attack okay i think it differs for you to realize good you are being followed by an ancestral spirit let be let, let, let's sit on ancestral spirit yeah. exactly on ancestral spirit there are signs there are signs that you can see physically right there are signs right. that you can see on your dream life okay number one people are followed by uh, ancestral spirits depending on which type of ancestral spirits remember they are abogogo which are female ancestral spirits they yes. come they manifest as female ancestral spirits then they are abom kulu right anasekuru right yeah the male ancestral spirits right so if you are being followed number one by a female a gogo you always dream yourself being at the water right you are coming from the church you are enjoying with your friends in the dreams all of a sudden you are by the river you are right. shocked why is it all of your dreams are associated with, with water. water it's either you go to the river bank or you go to the ocean every day you are swimming in re- reality you don't like water you are mm-hmm. not even you know water and you you are not really good friends right but each and every day when you dream it's very rare for you not to have a dream that is related to water then when it moves when it's powerful like when the spirits are coming with too much force you move from just dreaming about water you begin to dream about water oh, ma- marine life okay like aquarium that, life yeah things that lives in the water yes at first you might dream mermaids uh-huh. you never seen them like uh, physically physically but in the dreams you'll be yes. seeing them every yeah. day you swim with them mm. you go under the water you see those uh, snakes every day of your life like you see like I myself I know that I'm being followed but you know the funny thing about my life right. like when I am not really prayerful maybe because of some disturbances I am tired and so forth I begin to dream a lot of snakes but these snakes they will be sometimes cobras but right. you find them by the water yet uh-huh. they are cobras cobras you can't find they them stay by the in water the they don't stay there 
yeah. mountains and bushes. Right. But those ones, you, you number there are two things: the, the water spirits mm -hmm. and the other ones, which are represented by these snakes. snakes yeah. So you can either dream a a python, mm -hmm. the one that lives in the water, yeah, right. or a python that lives here in the bushes. Yeah, okay, yeah. All of those things they represent the ancestral spirits. spirits okay. We are talking about the dream life. Right. Sometimes you can dream yourself being at the graves. All or always, whenever you sleep, all of a sudden you find yourself uh, being at the the grave site. You mm. wonder why is it my dreams are always like always that? ending. And at some people they dream themselves dying every day. You are in the you are in the grave with your brothers and sisters. You are enjoying there, but you are dead all of your life. Right, Apostle. Maybe can I can I can I catch you there? Yeah. Um, dreaming. Meaning, when you are dreaming, it means you are alive. Yes. But you dream it's, being in the grave. Yeah, you are like, or being in a coffin. And it's an everyday thing. Anytime you, you can be in the coffin, you are, you are, you are dead. But you are, you, are, you are even questioning, why is it I am here? I am dead. I know that I'm dead. But I'm living, but I'm dead. Mm. You know, when you are dead, you are dead. But when you are in the dreams, you dream yourself being dead. You'll be functional. You'll, right. be, you, you'll be even talking to the other dead person by your next door. Oh, you're in. Yeah, like I myself, I used to dream with auntie when mm. I was growing as I was young. She right. was dead as well. Okay. Yeah, I didn't know what it means, but I was tired of those dreams from grade one and two around grade seven. Then they transformed to now you dream about water. You now dream about yourself falling from... You see, all those dreams where people, you, you are always on top of uh, a building. Then all of a sudden, you fall, right. but uh -huh. you don't reach the ground. Yeah. All of those dreams, they are symbolifying that you are being followed by the ancestral spirits. Uh, right. Like, let me give you the other one. I said water, snakes, uh, even some, some other people, they dream the animals that represent their totem. Let's okay. say your totem is a lion, right. Shumba. Uh -huh. You'll be always dreaming about a lion coming. Sometimes it doesn't do anything. When it comes to you, it begins to lick you like, mm -hmm. you know, yeah. Like they, yeah. they are they are recognizing yeah. you kind they of are, they are protecting you, they are doing whatsoever. It's a symbolism that these spirits are after you and they claim to be the owners of you. Of you. you are connected somewhere, somewhere. Mm. Then these are the dream, dream like the dream uh signs that you are being followed by the ancestral spirits, but they are also physical signs that can tell you that you are being followed. Number one is the fear of water. Right. When you go to any place with water, you don't, you are not being good friends. Number one is me. <laughs> <laughs> so we can't go to... We can, because to... I, we can by the virtue that I will say, I, I don't follow those spirits, but they traumatized me because I was dreaming myself in water every day. So when I okay. see water, my senses go back to the dream life. Those dreams. So I don't like that's like like when I'm flying in the plane. Remember number one, mm -hmm. I grew up dreaming of myself falling in the plane, falling everywhere. Right. Think, these are the signs that the spirits are following you. Now okay. whenever I'm in the plane, you start I, by thinking I'm that obviously you automatically you connect to the to the dream life that you grew up having. Then the other thing that will happen, man, mm -hmm. when like when I'm going to places like Cape Town, right? Automatically, when the, 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 the aeroplane is above the sea, the moment it gets to the sea, I wake up. Okay. I I I, I, I wake up. I feel it, Kuti. Uh, Majita, they are feeling good. The rebel is in this yeah. plane. That is why you see, I am heavily protected by angels. You had that dream that uh pastor wrote uh, mm -hmm. and the daughter had right. and they said uh, my, I and my daughter we had the same dream apostle was in the plane and angels were guarding the war plane right. I said I thank God it was revealed to you right. how heavily armed I am right. I am protected that way because whenever I step into an area with ancestral spirits the sense with the rebel the person who refused to work for us is right. now in the area so let's attack him but when they try to attack they see the war area i am covered with the angels so they, right. do, they do nothing okay so whenever i'm going into cape town port elizabeth deben so long it's near the ocean i wake up you feel it because they will be reacting with umjita 
Ula. Ula. Fikili. Ubambo. Umdala. Right? <laughs> you know. Yeah. So I, I, I'm very, very sensitive to it. I'm very sensitive to Do you know that uh, I, I always told you which I don't like to live in flats? Yes. Yes, you know that. Even it, I think on, on Saturday we were speaking about it again. Yeah, I said, but I, I, don't, I don't want a flat. I don't want a flat. I just want a house. It is because of uh, those kind of yes. experiences when you are growing up and you'll be not having anybody to tell who can explain to you. But growing up and spiritual experiences, they didn't teach you, to, oh, okay, these are the signs and they stopped because you began to pray and have a journey with God. Okay. So even in the Bible, you, right. you, you won't find it unless you meet somebody who is an experience and it stopped and it was forever. This is how the best. So number one, you fear, fear water. water. You fear snakes. snakes. Like myself. You're afraid I, of snakes. I don't like them. Right. Like I'm now beginning to, to, to learn to accept them as animals. Right. Like I can watch videos about snakes so that I can teach myself that these are just animals. Right. Besides all the experiences that I had. Mm-hmm. You remember when I did the marine spirit teachings when we started ministry when I said previous days I used to see a snake. This snake could be just in a in a river and I'm passing mm-hmm. by. It doesn't do anything. anything yeah. Then it disappeared. That snake right. is no longer coming. I no longer have those dreams yeah. because I conquered. Right. So me and the snakes because of the everyday experience in the dreams we are not good friends but nowadays I can watch a video like a snake is doing that but I'll be like shh, shh. <laughs> you know Moving uh, the, the, the trauma is still it's still there yeah it's still there okay. but I'm trying to teach myself to get used to goody. there is a difference between snakes in the spirit and snakes that are just animals they are just animals which are living their lives the number three now number three when you go and meet somebody who is uh, a sangoma or is uh, associated with the ancestral spirit you right. read you even become sick you can okay. catch the signal you can even go like you'll be trying to hold yourself you can feel it with there's something that something is reacting in there yeah you can go there is something it is because the elements in you they are reacting to the relatives the out relatives there. okay yeah. even there are plenty of pastors who can go by the areas where these things are being done they do that they do they, they feel it okay yeah. so father you tell me that uh, i remember there is a time uh, when we were still growing up yeah we heard that children have got better reception especially infants mm-hmm. they've got better reception than us adults mm-hmm. because the, i had my mom saying uh, be careful when you're going out with the kid. Make sure he has got a head or what or what, mm-hmm. because he can catch the waves or to, of whatever is happening. Yeah, kids. Remember, even Jesus said, "The kingdom of God belongs to such the little ones." Okay. Yeah. So meaning, like these when you people, when you are young, you are yes. more spiritual. Then as you grow, you are becoming more physical. Because remember, yeah. being physical, it doesn't have to do anything to do with the, how, 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 how big, how big the body is, yes. but the experience is in the flesh. Right. A kid has more spiritual experience. Is undiluted. Yeah, is undiluted, clean and fresh. The moment you begin to have some physical experiences, you are becoming carnal. All right. Because if you tell a kid with miracles don't exist, they will tell you that I lived in the womb for nine months. So which kind of miracle do you want? You want? Yeah. How, how can you explain that? There's no A in there. Yeah, there's no A. And I, I, there's I was, no light. I was growing. I was not. I was just sitting, but growing. Right. And then when the time came, uh, it came. I came out. So it's a, the life of a if a child is a miracle. Okay. It's a miracle. So when you begin to experience things of the flesh, carnality is growing also on you because. It's by experience. Okay. So kids are very sensitive to the things of the spirit. This is the reason why when you are a witch, when a child is given into your hands, she will cry. Yeah. He will cry. Or you can go stiff like yeah, someone like who has he, got he, epilepsy. You can really see what we are not. But those things, you need to be very careful. It's not always. Yes. Some other times, kids may even react because they are sick. Right. Yeah, they'll be crying. So if people stereotype things good when a baby is crying in the hands of somebody somebody clean will come and the baby will begin to cry it needs people we have understanding, understanding and yeah because uh, you uh, judge uh, every circumstance right eyes using one uh, concept st- uh, standard yardstick or whatsoever yeah. you understand mm. okay further 
What about? No, but, but we, haven't, we haven't finished about the signs. Yes, yeah. we are still on that one, that reaction part. Okay. Right. Tell me, what about if I'm meeting someone, I've heard this a couple of times, okay. that if I meet someone who is not right, my hair feels edgy. It depends. It depends with how gifted you are mm-hmm. and did your gift manage to pick up because remember in as much as we are things that we miss right. I myself I've missed a lot of things uh-huh. you are gifted but you miss a, 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 not talking about me a Samuel right also missed yeah John uh-huh. also missed yeah Elijah also missed so there are circumstances when you can get into a room with the wrong person mm-hmm. then the senses can catch you know like like here do you know if i tell you i'm still smelling death but now i'm smelling it around a person but it's still sensitive to talk about it right i'm saying so because i smell it now now it's not it's not you uh, because i'm scared when you no, say something no, like that no, no it's not you <laughs> it's not you right no, it's not if it was you i could have told you yes I but uh, it's around i i smell it then I will be like trying to tell the boys, Guti, do you smell what I'm smelling? I'll be scared when they begin to be they will begin to be scared. Right. And even the victim, mm-hmm. I would I'll, I'll be wanting to tell him, Guti, the spirit of death is not even far from you. It's right. here. Uh-huh. And it's still roaming around. Some, yeah, roaming yeah. around. And I I smell it deadly like I'm in the house which is full of dead bodies. Like in a mock, like a mom, yeah, mortuary, mortuary, yeah. yeah. I'll be smelling it. Then it disturbs me. I talk to the person a little. Then I run away. I go and pray for him. Oh, right. Why, why did I say him? What about if she's a late? <sighs> okay, right. Um, my dear, so you was in so everyone online. My point was right. You can sometimes. Mm-hmm. Sometimes you can't. Right. You can continue. Okay. Have you heard that there are physical things that you can um, go through or that you can come across that will make you know that you are being followed by ancestral spirit? There are also some spiritual things that you suffer and there will be pointers for you to know that uh, you are being followed by the marine or uh, these uh, evil spirits Mm. or ancestral spirits to be in, in particular. So, if you are one of the people who are suffering any of these things that we have discussed so far, tomorrow is your day. Tomorrow is your day. We will be doing witchcraft reversal all night prayer. And we have given it a name. Go back to sender. Tomorrow is your day. Tomorrow is your day. The address for the all night prayer is room number 101 number 376 Steve Biko Road that's at Acadia Center opposite Shell Garage corner Steve Biko and Joannis Ramakose my friend, my relative my brother, invite someone to invite someone that you know that has got this particular problem because the salvation is here thank you, we can go ahead Apostle what else is there for us to see that we are being followed by these ancestral spirits. We have spoken of uh, fear of water, fear of heights, and being edge. Yeah, okay. now we are talking about the physical signs, right? Yes. Yeah, then the love of uh, uh, dreadlocks. Okay. Yeah. Of all the hairstyles, you will choose dreadlocks and uh, you will be defending like them like, you know... <laughs> You, you. <laughs> and uh, I myself, I used to have them, and I was shocked. With all of a sudden, I fell in love with the dreadlocks, and uh, it was another sign. Like you see, even mining struggles with the air. Yes. Yeah, that air must be fixed. It right. needs to be prayed for so that it can right. be turned back. Deliverance is needed. Right. Because the only hairstyle that could fit your head were the dead dreadlocks, uh-huh. and we had to cut them right. and bend them. Mm-hmm. So that love of dreadlocks, plenty of people. When you are in Sangoma, 
like you have qualified, you have trained. Automatically, this year it becomes like that. You are not supposed to come it or whatsoever. Then it automatically becomes like, like that. that. Hey, to be yeah. natural, then it begins to grow. Yeah. So when you are being followed by those spirits, all of a sudden you end up having some dreadlocks and you defend them like you are fighting for, for your marriage. <laughs> yeah. Defending dreadlocks. Yeah, defending dreadlocks. Then there are two things which are opposite to each other. Right. It's either you become too smart or too dead. Okay. Mm. So plenty of people are being followed by the Abo Gogos. They are too smart. Right. Even after sweeping, they will sweep. Then after sweeping the second time, they will sweep again. Right. They are always sweeping. They don't want to see anything on the floor. Like, like they are too smart. They are extra smart to a level of boring. The right. people that can can wash dishes even seven times a day. Right. They clean their house the whole day from morning until night. A person comes, they sweep. Right. They dust the place that the person was sitting, was sitting on. on. They make sure the, the, the cushions, the and cushions are, 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 are in order. They are extra clean. It is not because of the cleanliness. Mm. May, maimeds have that character. They right. want to be smart. So the maimed spirit, when it's on you, you become extra clean. To, to such an extent that if somebody is cooking, if they can just scratch their head. Say, I'm telling you, you are disturbed. That food, you won't eat it. And the, but most of those people, they don't visit people. They, right. they want to be on their space in their house. Even if the house can be a one room, the way it will be smart will be shocking. You wonder what? What? She, she's just a one room with a little furniture, but it's every sparkling. I'm and telling you the truth. Yes. <laughs> okay, I have heard um, the people from Machinal and Central. They call people like that. Dona. Aneshavire Dona. Dona. Yeah, Dona is Manjuzu, something right. like that, right? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Mm. Yes. We can hear it all here. So, be in our shoes. Try and do an introspection of yourself. Compare yourself with what we are learning here. There, there is a comment that I'm reading. There. Right. Uh, she said, my, my, my apostle, beside red logs, of which she removed it today. Yesterday, I mean. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> right. she, right. she, right. she removed the dreadlocks yesterday. Mm, I wish if I could show you the new hairstyle, but I, I, I'm very sure she will show you on her own. I don't want to interfere with the <laughs> hair stuff, you know. <laughs> <laughs> right. We can hear it from the horse's mouth. Our father is an expert in these things. Um, we also have an audio series of witchcraft from part one up to part eight. Um, to those that are still struggling with English, yeah, you can have it upon request. Yeah, on, in Shona it is one to eight. Yes. In Shona you can request the witchcraft series. You can learn it all in Shona, but now yes. we are doing it for the other people yes. who don't have... Uh, uh, in understanding in yes. Shona, you understand. Right. As we are going ahead, Father, you say that those that are too smart, it's a yeah. resemblance of a spirit that is following you. Yeah. How about the dirty side The now? dirty side man. Abomkulu. Mm. Are they, they, Abomkulu, they are not smart. They, they only are bath hunters. when they are going for, they, a bar, yeah. for a bus. Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, always on times they are hunting. Right. So the hunters and smartness is not really a good thing, mm. a, a good a friendship. They are always dirty. They are always like, you know, they concentrate on hunting only. And those people, they can have a lot of money, but bathing will still be a problem to them. They are plenty celebrities. I can't talk about them. Yes. There is another guy who is just... Mm -hmm. And he's rich, but if you look at him, you wonder which kind of an animal is that. Yeah, and right. if you ask people around him, they'll tell him, tell you, he smells. But mm -hmm. money is there, but he still smells. It is because he is concerned about money. He's a big businessman. He's concerned about money, not anything. He might be knowing it. He might be even be doing the, the, rituals. the rituals. And the rituals about those guys, it's not like they kill people. No, they yeah. just follow. They live according to it. In the morning, 
yavuka ekuseni vuke ekuseni upahle right upahle then wenze but in the that multi mixture and yeah multi mixture yeah my vele porridge yeah and snuff snuff okay yeah snuff you put it and you put a little bit of mkombot right. on the ground you just leave it there nobody can wipe your post or your your, your corner that you do your stuff right. then they go to work they go in the hustle then when they are they win they go uh, emlanjen all right yeah do you know emlanjen hey, no 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 i'm not sure no emlanjen we are talking about the uh, at the water where the re, yeah, reeds the, where, where the, the water flows oh like a waterfall yeah as okay. we can see emlanjen okay it's a monday uh, or uh, after a successful hunting all right you did your hustle you played your soccer bits and you come back awaiting results or after results after results okay you come back right spong you are thinking back uh, to to the spirits which are helping you do this so your life is centered around it even in your pocket there will be some money which you keep you don't give anybody which will be a contact point from your own corner that you do your stuff this is the reason why i said people must bring money on sunday right. i want to pray for their money mm. so that anything that miss their money it's clean because the money that we are having sometimes yaka paselwa sometimes some a lot a lot happened and he asked mm. we don't have the money power we need that right. we need that I, th- i don't think i can be followed by a, a like a, an orthodox christian i don't think he can follow me like okay let me let me not say use the orthodox like a christian who is not into the spiritual things right who is just uh, into the things which are logic right and uh, everything must be written somewhere in the scriptures that christian is not meant to be led by me i'm not hating the scriptures everything that you're talking about here i can back it with any scripture right but i'm saying my experience mm. in the other world taught me a lot that it's even difficult for me to go on a corner where people are just cooking food because i know that before they cook food if they are into the cultural things or traditional things things that are done there if you are told you can't eat but right. sometimes you have to sit on the pot uh-huh. yeah you dance and uh, you dance naked sometimes your whole oh, women would system it to go have to go into the pot so that you mix with that yeah so it mixes <laughs> <laughs> then and the men men yeah. love love that like when men are following ladies yes. they are not following the face uh-uh. you, you know what they are following right so that power that that drives that men following place. power yeah yes. what is, so you you right. be coming to buy there because of that So I saw it happening now it's very difficult for me to trust every lady who I can just eat everything sometimes why is this you know father this thing that you have just mentioned when I was teaching at Lala Pansi high a few years ah this is no longer a few uh, it's about 15 years ago mm, there was a child who was in one of my classes one day he came to me and this other senior teacher we were in the same department and said um eh bana say please we, when you are buying milis from my mother bri- buy the bright one don't buy the boiled then this madala was with no skin on the face <laughs> he didn't he worry he said it straight he said it straight yeah he said why are you saying that i can't mention names the little boy said My mother every evening when she is boiling the the millies she boils it with the water that she has bathed my little brother with with because people love kids so the power in the kids goes there mm. do you know that you are one of the few people who have contributed to me that I eat boiled millies seriously especially from the street <laughs> <laughs> when you were not eating never ah, ah no, only, but, but you, I, you must check most of, most of the times i buy from guys yes uh, ladies, yeah, uh, i buy from guys <laughs> not ladies, from ladies. <laughs> ladies. Ladies. So, but, but if you don't have an experience you will not understand you, it you, you, you'll be thinking good these people
people you know they are just too serious about everything they, right. they just don't trust my guy if you are you want experience uh, th- these things they can never happen in, in the middle of the road they right. happen privately then the happenings happens now publicly then the last experience i had we went for an outreach uh, it was actually it was an attachment outreach mm. when we were still in college there in shuruki side there was one road that bush road those shortcuts there were ladies pens that were laid on the road like every 100 meters you find one 100 meters you find one and that distance it was in tokwe for there we had to travel about five kilometers in the bush and we would see different panties then this other guy now he is a pastor at um, in binga mm. he said uh, pastor kamonga tell me now pastor kamonga is in botswana and this guy is called stanley mzamba i'm talking about he even asked pastor kamonga explain to me what is happening it has been ladies beds all the way what's happening what's happening he explained it exactly the same way that there is muti involved with this yeah there's muti there's a spirit yeah, like like you know when we went drawing to, power yeah when we went to cape town Right. We saw a lot of ladies pins like bras mm. in the, the place they were they were thrown nobody could even go there unless you go there maybe for prayer. Then we are going for baptism. We saw a lot of things, chickens which we said a lot of I did a video and people were shocked with what's happening. I said this yeah. is this is the life that we are living. Right. We are not free. We are not free. They are scavengers, monsters. We who, who, who are be, you, you are busy saying these things they don't exist in their world they are doing the practical yes you understand so that that's the reason why i said a person who just like is all he knows are the scriptures mm. can't follow me because i'll be talking about other things which are just uh, experiential i right. experienced it and i saw it then when i'm telling you man you you, you, were, you were brainwashed with mm. everything must be written in the Bible. Right. Now we are not talking about things that are written in the Bible. We're we are speaking talking about, about things that were lived. Practical life. Yeah, thing, things that were lived, things that people are living in. Mm. Because the Bible was written and it ended on its own time. Right. But the things that happened after when the Bible was written, what about them? Right. You understand? Um, the scriptures are the basis of everything. Right. But experience is another best teacher. That can help you understand the things. If you don't understand them, that is why, do you know the, the reason why the churches are different? Some other people, they come from other churches and they come to churches like this. It is because this church will be not addressing your problem. You are having it, then they are tell, telling you it doesn't exist. doesn't exist. So they will go to a church which can address their problems. Because you are going to a church that, that, that doesn't believe in manifesting. Right. And then you have a child who is waking up every midnight, walking, talking. Right. She's sleeping, but she's walking and talking. Right. And then your pastor tells you there is nothing There's like nothing like that. So you will just leave the church and go to the church that addresses your problem. Your problem. Right. Mm. Wow. We can hear it all. It's not everything that happens in our life by coincidence. As we are going for a break. Which song are we going to hear, Apostle, today on this break time? I think they can suggest in the comment section. Right. Tell us which song you want to hear as we would like to go on the uh, commercial break. While at least uh, you are telling us which song you want us to play, remember, all these things that we are discussing here, if they are following your life, please, please, you need to seek spiritual attention. And we are offering that tomorrow. At Acadia Center, number 376, Steve Biko Road, corner Steve Biko and Joannis Ramakose. Uh, it will be an all-night prayer. And every Sunday, we hold our Sunday services from 9 to 2 p.m. And there is a serious wave of the Holy Spirit. We don't believe that people must go back home the same. We believe in serious deliverance and the empowerment of God's people on the face of the earth. Thank you. Yeah, so when we come back, we are going to look at uh, the last uh, physical signs that help you to see 
if you are being followed by ancestral spirit. Right. Of course, we are not going to leave you like that. Mm. There is a moment we are going to explain how to get rid of those, those things. things. Right. In the, I was a victim, but today I'm free. So I believe if you can follow, you also be helped. It's just a commercial break. We are coming to finish up with you. May God bless you.
Mbeleno tutaoro. Everything is in loggerheads with the uh, against the nature. Mm. Even things are going tough. Mm. We have to worship God Thank you. because He is the one who takes care of us. That is what the song is saying. Welcome back, Apostle. Thank you, sir. Right. As we are continuing with them, what we are saying. So there is a lot of things that people do mm-hmm. that is associated with ancestral worship which is associated with ancestral type of witchcraft yeah. right things of using the rule of nature against other people mm. right so as we have said earlier on if any of these things that we are talking about here like dreaming the water life the aquarium systems dreaming of your totem Vanashumba, you'll be dreaming lions. Monkeys like myself, dreaming monkeys all over. Mm -hmm. Right. You must know that something is not adding up. It must raise attention, Uh, even on physical life. I'll tell you one more thing. Right. Some became gays. Right. Because they have been followed by a woman. Yeah, by a... Uh, do you remember in the Bible there is a lady who was having a spirit mm. and uh, the Bible says he referring to the spirit right the the spirit was a, a male a male yet inside a female a female so plenty of people who were who, 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 who were being followed by spirits like gogos mm. some of them instead of becoming sangomas they became gays because right. the nature of the spirits in whatsoever that is making mm. that, 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 that it's making them to feel so they ended up being gays and after being a gay they just began to follow their traditional stuff later but already they started this right, like you see yeah. some they became lesbians mm-hmm. because the spirit that is following them is a, a, a male who, spirit a, who, um, cool. So yet you are a you, woman. you start by having a character of a guy. Mm. You like to be a guy. You feel like you You're have to be a guy. Yeah. Even when a you, 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 you a guy wants to fight you, you, you can, can feel good. I can. You, you, you are just saying rubbish. I can fight you, right? But if you are not helped, you become a a lesbian because you feel so. It is not because you feel so. It is because of the spirit that is inside you and you end up being a lesbian so in, in other p- points we are saying you are a guy you feel like a lady definitely the sign that the spirits are following you you are a lady you feel like you are a guy even the anger that you have even mm. the mingling that you right. do with guys mm. when you meet guys you feel it's, do you know under normal circumstances every lady must feel abnormal to be around guys right but there are ladies who feel like when they see boys they've seen one one friends. one of the about every guy you know when you have a lady you know how it goes yeah. you know it yeah then you 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 are saying these are my fellows there is nothing like that those are some of the signs that um, somewhere somehow there is a spirit that makes you to feel like guys are your mates ladies are your mates because the spirit the nature of the spirit is that too is stronger for your character you can't hold it okay mm. with this point apostle mm. i believe it doesn't dispute or run away from the fact that there is what is called hormone disorder mm-hmm. yeah, 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 or talking, the devil is taking advantage yeah, 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 talking about of something like listen, that listen listen here on this out mm-hmm. 
one of the days right Gogo Tata came with one of the daughters who left the mm -hmm. the daughter came and when I prayed for her she changed mm -hmm. her face she became, I'm sure you were there if I'm not mistaken she changed her face became like a lion yeah like he, he became <laughs> she changed you could see but no no man can love such a lady right so you are telling me well, these are just hormones or there is a spirit behind obviously there is a spirit. of course there are there is a spiritual explanation of everything there is also a medical explanation yes. of everything mm -hmm. you, uh, you have a spirit you are sick you can still go to the hospital they can tell you what your problem is this but yet it's a spirit that is only, right. only troubling you so we can say homo now imbalance and what what what's propelling that right uh, there you comes to the real answer yeah there is a spirit so we are keeping on going back that there is a driving force yeah everyone has got a potential yeah but that potential is looking for a place to resonate and detonate when you see david killing goliath right don't think it's normal mm -hmm. this guy was anointed by some by god already so that anointing that is in him is the one it's which is driving force yeah right uh -huh. So that that's where the, 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 the you can you can have any medical laboratory okay. scientific explanation, mm. but at the end of the day, these things they are spiritual. Right. Going back to the physical, mm. you'll have the fear of the waters. Yeah, fear of the waters. Fear of the heights. Fear of heights. Um, love of dreadlocks. Yes. Being too smart or too dirty. Yes. Can we continue from there? Uh, you hate dead bodies. Right. Yeah, because Abom Kulu and Abom Gogo, they usually when they on funerals, they don't, they, 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 they are very far from, or like, like you, you need to check. Right. Like if, if a person is a Sangoma, mm -hmm. like when the closer relatives dies and so forth, they don't come closer to the dead bodies or even view the body. Right. I just and want I, to highlight and something. I'm one of them. You know me and dead bodies. Uh, you know, I we suffered that fate late last year when something happened. It was a tragedy. Then I was with my brother, uh, one of our producers, brother Ishmael. Yeah. We saw that there was two. There were two guys on that particular incident. I will not mention where it happened. Those two guys during the time when we were supposed to go and identify and bring the body to where we can do body viewing. The other one went on call. Yeah. The other one just vanished. Yeah. And they resurfaced when we were done packing yes. everything into the yeah. trailer. Yeah. I'm, I'm not scared of anything. I, I, I myself, you can put a dead body, I can sit. Right. But because of grace now. Because of history, like mm -hmm association like when you grow up when jesus did it not yet come into our lives to rescue us from these spirits they were doing whatsoever they wanted with our bodies so our bodies are programmed mm -hmm. that way you understand so right. we need to, to like the only time that i i was close to a like a a, 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 a a body which is lifeless was when we lost our boy right i was praying for him holding him perhaps right. god could bring him back uh -huh. I was broke, I'd, I'd broken. I'd I, broken. I never cared. Right. I never cared. You understand? But uh, when you are, when they terrify you, because a dead body is nothing. It's just a dead body. But some other people, they, they, they act like it's something. Because why? The spirits that you are following you, they claim to be the spirits of the dead people. Mm -hmm. So the trauma is it's associated with the that. people who are being followed by those spirits. Wow. Yes. So it's not every fear or every action that can be justified easily. Even fear of graves. I think that also... You really know what these people, they are dead. And they are even buried. Yeah. And uh, if they were powerful, they could have resisted being buried. But uh, when you go into the graves, us, we can even go into the graves and forget that we are there. Right. Some other people, <laughs> when they are crossing, <laughs> their hearts are like... Ah! I remember, uh, I think that was around 1998, my lovely brother, and I respect him up to today, his first job, he was digging graves. 
and yeah. you took care of me from that job mm. of digging graves mm. so i remember this other lady that he, he loved so much he had to ask do you think i will enjoy the money that you get from the graveyard <laughs> just like the graves are giving him money but yet he was formerly employed from the municipality and you know i'm associating with what you are saying yeah. fear of association with anything that is said is dead yeah. can even break a relationship yeah you see so these are the physical signs that can tell you good they are plenty mm -hmm. i was thinking about some but uh, they just uh, some are sicknesses and uh, you are always sick with, mm -hmm. with, 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 with with sicknesses that the doctors can't identify you go to scans, you go everywhere, they can't identify loot. You can feel that uh, there's a problem in me. You go to the doctors, they scan, any kind of scan. You know, we had plenty of situations like those here. Okay. Yeah. So that, that, that uh, in this uh, study we are doing here, they call it an ailment. Yeah. That, the, the, the thing that they'll be trying there, they want everybody to fail and they will provide the solution. the solution. Then you accept them and begin to follow them. Right. Yeah. So there is also big egg. Right. Big egg. Mm -hmm. Remember when you are Mkulu, your back is well, like not Mkulu, Ukogo. Ukogo. Abu Kogo, their right. backs are always painful. Even Abu Mkulu, yeah. they, their backs are always painful. So the spirits, when it's coming as a gogo, -go, definitely are going to struggle with a back. So you will be young, you are 20 years, you are 18 years, but already have a back problem. Not only a back problem, even the legs. Right. Sometimes even the headache. I, why headache? Because you know when you are possessed by an evil spirit, you always feel a headache. Yeah. So when they are following you, when they come into contact with your body and you are a positive person, your head begins to ache always you always you are consistently having a headache so it becomes like a migraine headache yes in the you try everything any med, any kind of medicine it can't help but you are sick then right. it's a sign that these ancestral spirits are following you then you enjoy game meat more than than anything okay the only thing that you love is game meat of all you want and you are staying in the middle of Pretoria like us. Uh, imagine you are in Arcadia. Then the only thing that you, you, you can you can go to wherever they say the game meat is. And the other thing you can love to eat darker soil. Right. Yeah, like the one they sell in the markets whatsoever. Like when it's raining, when it goes, you like that smell. Mm. You like that right. smell. Even the love of Mbanje. Okay. Yes, the love of Mbanje. Those people, they love Mbanje. Like, even the ladies who are Sangomas, ask them the way they love Mbanje. Oh, so that's why they call it the herb of, uh, of wisdom. Yes, they love it. They love it so much. So, you love Daga, you want to eat the soy always, and you like even the smell when it rains. You see, the signs are just plenty. Even pride itself. Because those spirits, they feel like they own everything. Right. So you can, you, you have you ask why this person has any pride? Like she mm. doesn't have anything. He doesn't have anything. It is because the spirit is like that. That's their nature. Oh, you, have you ever seen when they when they come? Mm. Oh, the ones you should pick and they they feel themselves. Yeah. <laughs> Right. Then he, they, they begin to ask for the induku. Mm. Then they will be like, like where, where is my road? Where is my road? You give them, they, they, they will be closing their eyes like this. You give them induku. Then after that, I'm naked, I'm naked. <sighs> then you give them the cloth. No, not that one. And now they are closing their eyes. They can feel the cloth that you, you, you gave me. me not the right then you give them the cloth they want they feel now thank you thank you so much like i'm now putting it in in english right 
from there everything is calm they greet you ah, I think I'm, I'm talking too much about these things eh? right I even attended this other ceremony ah, we were small boys when the spirit was arriving eh, the guy had to roar you see when an aeroplane is taking off that was kind of the spirit that they produced wow give me water where i'm coming from is very hot it's very hot that's what that, 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 that that's the, that, 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 that's the other thing they ask for water or either umtombot right yeah it's water umtombot when they come so where are you coming from they they are even specific where i am coming from is very hot not just hot but <laughs> very hot but i wish right i wish what i wish mm. i wish if i had stayed around in the land but i was very i could just see and say ah this thing doesn't have anything to do with me so i learned but there are some other things that i was saying ah they're still missing but, kind of yeah uh, i was not even concentrating like but i wish if i had learned more i'm telling you but i, I learned everything the whole processes i know about them but uh, if i could have been telling you other deeper more than this but i think for today right we need to end there then we continue on monday, monday. yes right we have heard it my relatives friends viewers gm family online we have heard it from our father there are things that you must watch out for when you want to realize or discover the spirit that is following you so the first type of spirit mm, how to identify it is the ancestral spirit be it to gogo or umkulu they are some things that happens in your life naturally that will be following you like the natural fear of water heights um, the love of dreadlocks at times being too smart or being too dirty fear of the corpse of some corpse fear of even the graveyards the extreme fear lack also um, having being struck with strange elements sicknesses that have got no definition that I never been in a trial laboratory to find a medication for they try everything but you won't see because the spirits will be wanting to put you in pain so that they can provide you a solution that you can go along with right the love of soil the love of gamut darker hey, those things are, are serious for them I'm we see a lot of women I'm telling you at first we thought maybe the body will be demanding for for extra calcium but now i'm i'm i'm, I'm seeing something then finally we say it before you the conclude there dreams. there is the love of ladies uh-huh yeah because remember abom kulu they could have plenty ladies if it's off yeah one man i'm telling you i think if the bible could allow it some of us would have been having strength right mm. why because the spirits will be propelling you to do that and you'll be thinking good it's normal mm. some other love of because i want to tell you the truth right did as we are coming from uh, dead backgrounds yes we did a lot of things mm -hmm. we could be having even 50 girlfriends one person right but now not even any kind of dead deal what is it well it, it tells you the, 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 the love is not in the mm. flesh is in the spirit in the spirit if it was in the flesh we could have been struggling with it now now yes because the, what is in the flesh is very very difficult mm. but we were like that but when we changed the spirit to operate with it's gone it's like we are one of those people who are well organized and who are not really into those things but we were once into it humanizing like fish uh, like dogs but right. today it's a different story so some other people they love ladies like you want mm. to what you can never be be satisfied by one you want plenty it is because of the polygamy spirit, spirit. that is within a, the ancestral oh, spirit right mm. you know father you have just raised something in conclusion uh the way i was smoking i think it was also yeah, yeah. Ah. 
because I Th- remember very well the way I was smoking. <laughs> I could smoke more than what I would drink. <laughs> that was very, very serious. I th- but when I decided to, to, to take things of God serious, mm. I saw myself being wind easy, easy. But other people, they take years. They, some even die when they You decide, see, just like that. Quit. Just like that. Because I have secret, I know it. You can go to jail, but you can say, yeah, yeah, don't worry about ladies, just give me a cigarette. G- bring me cigarettes, I will be fine. People can be given cigarettes to exchange with food. Right. They give you food, you, they, they take sell cigarettes. it to get cigarettes. Right. So you see, guys and family, that these things can go to extremes. Extreme levels. Right. So the next session, we'll be also checking how do you see that the 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 the, the the evil spirit or the, 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 the witchcraft spirit is following you. Um, like, let's say we'll be talking about the... the let, let, let's say, how do you see, see that you are bewitched? Right. Oh, how mm. do you see yeah. you are bewitched? I think that would be good. I think that would be better mm-hmm. as well. Right. We, we talked about how do you see if the evil spirits, uh, the ancestral, the ancestral spirits, spirit is are following, following you. you. If next week we can talk about how, how do you, you see, see could, this is witchcraft acting on me now ah, that would be very very uh, interesting and right so uh, this one will be very interesting yeah 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 mm. yeah, 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 yeah. we want to thank you all for being with us um let's make it a date on monday exactly at eight o'clock p.m we'll be in here discussing and assuming serious secrets on how you see that you are being bewitched. Yeah, and uh, next week we'll be not doing every day. It will be Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Right. Yeah. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much, Apostle, for this. So, what's the song for the day? Kushika Janaka. Until things are fine. We are not going to let this series go until things are fine. We are not going to look back until things are Fine. Brother Ishmael, we thank you for the visuals. We thank you for the broadcast um, and your crew. Thank you very much. Thank you so From much, myself, media team. Uh, don't, don't say goodbye. Oh, we need polls. There comes the song, Kusika Janaka. Please, can you read the song? The scale is 0 to 10. 0, less likely. 10 I don't know. most likely. Some, something went wrong. I don't know why it's not playing. Oh, the song wants to play Jealousy. It's playing, but I don't know why is it not in the cable. It's playing. Uh, are we still connected to Bluetooth? I can't see the Bluetooth sign there. No, it's not about Bluetooth. Let's see. It's mixer three, right? Yes. Uh, viewers all over the world, I don't know what happened with your mixer three. I think the engineers are attending to it. All right, the engineers are attending as we are going to play for you the song. You can rate it over 10. It's mixer three, right? Wow, this one is, is, is a very interesting topic, yeah? Right, People yes. have a loan to let. And what did they... And the other one offer. Ah, uh, guys, this thing is Arambas and Nazi. Why is this someone doing this to us? I don't know. Maybe it's, it's witchcraft. <laughs> yeah, witchcraft doesn't want to give people peace even when they're on their own home. Okay, what connected there? It is, yeah. Bluetooth couldn't connect. Huh? 
So let's call it a day. It's fine. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. We just experienced the okay. technical issue here. Um, Finally. Okay. There it goes. It comes. <laughs> I